Hey, what's up? Hello, everyone. Welcome in, welcome in. How are you guys doing today? I'm doing pretty phenomenal. Pretty phenomenal, I have to say. We're gonna be playing a new game today. A new game called Moonglow Bay. Get this. There we go. So I can have this and Twitch chat. Just not as convenient. All right, let's see how that goes. But anyways, I'm gonna be playing this new game called Moonglow Bay. I think it's designed to be played with a controller, so we're gonna attempt that, but as y'all know, I am not a controller player usually. But we've been playing Feed the Cups with a controller. I played um, Flame in the Flood the other day with a controller, so you know, we've had some practice lately. I'm gonna give it a go and kind of see, uh, see how it goes for us. All right, who are you? All these people are so little and cute. Okay. Um, I like this old man. Um, I also like this person. Um, they're all so cute and different and unique. This one and this one look related. Right? Like a male female version of the same character, I feel. And then these ones are just like off the wall. I kind of want to be this old guy. This one's cute though too. And kind of like ambiguous, which I like. I'm gonna be old man. Uh, he pronouns. Oh, what's our name? Uh, how do I? How do I do I do it on keyboard? Is that is it keyboard something? I guess so. Okay, our name is gonna be what's an old man name? Help me out, chat. A good old man name. Uh, I'm thinking like George or like, but I feel like he's gonna be a cool old man. So maybe like. Uh, uh, <laughs> I just I'm just thinking of presidents' names, like Abraham, <laughs> George. What's what's a good president name? Uh, uh, Harrison. We're gonna call him Harrison. Okay, we're gonna be Harrison. Done. Uh, oh, who's your partner? We get to have a friend? Is it gonna be Robin? Maybe it's Robin, our grandchild. Because I did like them. All right. Uh, they're gonna be they, them pronouns for funsies. All right, start game. We're so cute. We're in this tiny fishing thing. Am I on a boat? I am on a boat. Harrison, come on, you guppy. Grab the line. Fishing is easier than it looks, I promise. What are you afraid of? Nothing, except for the water, the monsters, the curse. You know what the locals say. They're just stories. Every one of them, I promise. Here, let me show you the basics. Follow along with me. Huh. First, stand in a decent fishing spot, like at the edge of the boat, right here, and then select the fish and hook icon to begin. Oh, okay. Now to cast the line. Fish will be more cautious if you cast near your boat or the shore. The further you cast, the more likely something will bite. Hmm. Press and hold to cast your line. The longer you hold, the greater the distance. Uh -huh. Perfect. Now, be patient. Keep the lure still and wait for something to bite. Uh. The moment the lure dips under, press and hold RT to hook the fish, or be quick or it might escape. Uh. Once hooked, continue holding RT to reel it in. Okay, be patient. We're good at fishing. I have patience for fishing. Definitely. Duh, duh, duh. He's, he's getting away from me. 
Uh, never mind. You'll catch the next one. Hold RT to reel in the empty line. I, I did. I did do that. Did I fish again? Is that a fish? I don't know if the, like... Well, it is a fish. It just told me to hold it. Oh, there we go. Hmm. Fish will change direction as they try to break free. Move in the opposite direction. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, am I catching it? I did it! A grating bellyfish. Okay, if you say so. Huh. See? Easy when you get the hang. Give it another go, this time, without my help. I kind of was already doing it without your help, I'm not gonna lie. So those little splotches, the dark splotches. Are they fish? I don't know. I'm doing a great job. I'm a fisher. That's right. Harrison knows what's up. Woo! Alright, keep it. Hmm. Fantastic. And a different species. We'll need a variety to cook and sell for our new business. Oh, we're selling fish? What's that, the Kraken? We got a dog too. They're cute. Oh, that's not a Kraken, but it's big. Whatever it is. Got a bunch of stuff. Ah! It's the monster! The curse! Come to torment us! Ah! <sighs> Uh, this town's ridiculous superstitions. No wonder the fishing trade is ruined. <laughs> but the base full of amazing creatures, all waiting to be discovered. We'll find them and share with the world. Mm. On that note, here, to celebrate our new adventure. Mm. Hey, what happened to no more surprises? Feels like a book? I'll open it tomorrow night once you're back. Mm. You still want this, right? We could always go back to Ontario. <laughs> of course. Moving here? It's your dream. But I'm asking what you want. What's your dream? Mm. My dream hasn't changed in 40 years to spend every day with you. <laughs> and I'll be right here the whole journey by your side. Welcome home. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, oh my. I, <laughs> I didn't realize that we were uh, in a relationship. <laughs> But that's cute. Three years later. Why do I look sad? What happened to her? I mean, to them, sorry. Forgetting the pronouns I set myself. Oh, puppy. <laughs> what is that? Knock, knock, knock. Who's here? Oh, wrong door. Why are they knocking at the back door? Oh, I pet the dog by accident. But it's fine. Calm down, pupper. <laughs> hey, dad. Oh. River, why aren't you in Quebec? Hmm. I gave my notice. Some things are more important. Is this it? Hmm. Presumption of the aforementioned believed to be dead owing to an absence of no less than three years. Wow, it's all so 
for real. Oh, she's getting us out of our depression. Huh. It's great you're here, but I'm fine, honestly. Mm. Actually, I got a new job. I'm overseeing the Centennial Festival. Ooh. You're doing what? Here? In Moonglow? Ah. The mayor says it'll be a huge boost for the community. Uh. And people need the support. The whole bay's been struggling for years. Mm. When the fishing trade collapsed, half the town closed down. Mm. If we can't attract new visitors soon, Moonglow Bay might never recover. <gasps> anyway, uh, on to brighter things. It's time you open that present. From mom? Or from, well, I guess, is it her mom? I don't I don't know. What is this? Oh. Uh, uh? The fishing journal? <sighs> to my darling Harrison, for the journey, by your side. You've been holding on to this for three years, Dad. Maybe it's time to write a new chapter. Mm -hmm. You're saying I should restart the business? Oh, she went missing literally the day... Or, sorry, they went missing literally Robin. They went missing literally the day after that first, like, cutscene that we saw, basically. When we were on the boat together. So it was literally the day after we moved. They went on, like, a trip, and he was like, I'll open it when you get back. And she never came back. Or they never came back. I'm gonna mix myself up. Anyways. You're saying I should restart the business? Oh. Precisely. Oh, this is River. Robin. Oh, River Robin. That's confusing. All right. Precisely. A new street food stall is exactly what this town needs. Oh. You would be an inspiration. We should head out right now. Catch some ingredients. Hmm. Okay. Okay. But let me tidy first. If I'd known you were oh. coming. And Runa surprise. <laughs> okay. I'll be down on the beach. Uh, hi, Robin. It's been three years. Some days are a little easier. Others are impossible. Oh, this is our journal. Okay. This is, we're writing this to our, our lost love. <clears throat> Hi, Robin. It's been three years. Some days are a little easier, others are impossible. Last week, a letter arrived declaring you dead in absentia, so naturally our daughter dropped everything to come here. Thank you for my journal. I'll treasure it always and write to you often. Cute. Our daughter has suggested I restart the street food business. I know a great little spot to catch some ingredients. I suppose a dozen empty noodle packets isn't a fantastic look for the house, though. Gotta clean up the trash. Uh, that present you gave me, where did I put it? I'm not expecting anyone. Oh, these are the other things that we did. Got you. So these are our current quests. Got it. Alright, so I gotta tidy up the house a little bit. Oh, I like the little trash bin in our hands. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's clean up. Clean up the trash. A dozen to-go containers. Looks like he's only eaten Chinese food for weeks. Poor guy. Alright, uh, clean up some more trash. More trash. Uh, there's a book on the floor here. Can I pick that up? Not right now. Trash. Okay, that's the last of it. The trash can's outside, since you clearly forgot, Fisher. Uh, out back, out front. We have three doors to this place. I guess it's out front. Task complete. Sweet. Okay. Is that a raccoon? Get away from my trash. How do I... Oh, here it is. I'm like, how do I look... Oh, this game has co-op? That's cool. Um, help, I'm stuck. Options, resume. Oh, here we go. Okay. So, meet River at the beach. I have to go to Central Beach. I have the two fish from three years ago. Love that. Um, these are our recipes. We know how to make fish and chips and fish cakes. And then it tells us how to unlock some of the other recipes. That's cool. I like it. I like it. Crystal, thank you for the headpads for blue. This shows what we've caught. Um, give the species to Marina at the local aquarium for more information. Okay, cool. Um, there seems to be a lot of fish we can catch. Lots of pages there. This is like notes. And then this is the map. Here we go. Uh, you okay, Dad? You look a bit lost. Yeah, I'm just looking for the, um, you know, the place that sells the things. Mm. 
if you're looking for somewhere specific in town, just check out your map. Your map displays all shops, business, and points of interest. Just press that button at any time. Okay, cool. So we need to go to this place. So I will track. There we go. Okay, so now I should be able to go there. Yeah, raccoon, get out of here. Running down the sidewalk. You were right. The streets are so empty. I barely noticed before. The town needs investment. Pure and simple. But at least you have everything you need for your business. Huh. Your fishing rod, your kitchen, and a place to sell food. Huh. First things first. Let's catch some ingredients. Okay. I know how to do this. My partner taught me how to do this three years ago before they disappeared. Hi, pupper. The strike, move against the fish direction of fishing, then press LT. Don't strike too often or you'll tire yourself out. Uh, it's when they get stuck, kinda. I did it! I caught a ling, a new one too. Let's go. Alright, agile, small. Yeah, yeah, I know it's light on actual information. I'm an accountant, not a blubbin' marine biologist. Huh. I'm sure the aquarium can help fill in the details. Huh. Since we're here, let's recap water behavior and luring. Hmm. When reeling a fish, it will behave in one of three ways depending on its species. Huh. Fast species will dart around quickly to wriggle free. Reflexes are key. Mm -hmm. Aggressive species will use a combination of speed and strength to escape. Huh. Finally, resilient species are slow moving but strong. It'll take several powerful strikes to haul one in. Mm. Fortunately, you can attract specific fish by using lures. Oh. Give it a go. Select a lure and cast your line. So we've collected a strong and an agile fish. Oh. Lure? The jig lure will attract aggressive and resilient fish. Yeah. The spinner lure will attract fast and aggressive fish. Mm. The plug lure will attract resilient and fast fish. Remember to check which lure you're using when you cast. Uh-huh. Here, let's do the spinner lure. Why not? I know, Ba. I know I gave you lots of good treats for lunch, huh? Yeah, you're welcome. I need to try to catch this fish, Nova. Got it. A striped nibbler. Oh. Perfect. Finally, a word on bait. Uh -huh. Baiting your line is essential to catching larger species of fish. There are two types, low grade and high grade. If you cast with no bait, you'll attract small species. With low grade bait, you'll attract small and medium species. And with high grade bait, you'll attract medium and large species. Uh -huh. Try it now. Looks like I only have low grade bait, so... Um, let's try, uh, the plug lure with the bait. Another striped nibbler. Huh. Excellent. Remember, there's a huge range of sea creatures out there, so mix up your lure bait and location to catch a variety. Whoa. Just be aware that your bait is limited, so be careful you don't run out. Yeah. Under the sea market, until the sea market reopens, high grade bait in particular will be in short supply. <laughs> Whoa! Stop the press. Harrison Fisher is out of the house before midday. Hmm. Hey, Abby, you remember River? Ooh. Of course, what brings you to our shabby little burg? Wait, Harrison, is that... You finally opened it? 
It's a fishing journal. Robin and I had a thing for these waters once. In fact, I'm reviving the business, selling street food straight from the ocean. Harrison, you are gonna... <laughs> Nice, thanks, Abby. Oh. Sorry, sorry, but three years, you never once struck me as, like, outdoorsy. Maybe it's time for a change. Yeah. In that case, Captain Noodles, you're gonna... You're gonna peddle piscine cuisine from the most cursed cove in Canada. <laughs> I insist you learn how to cook. Follow me. She's cute. Okay, Harrison, if you're selling street food, your kitchen's gonna be your new best friend. To create a meal, you need three things. Raw fish, the recipe, and enough shells to cover the cost of any extra ingredients. Yeah. Collected recipes will appear in your journal. When you step into the kitchen, you can browse and choose which meals you want to make. Alright, so we can make fish and chips and fish cakes. Um, fish cakes only require fish, which is why I can make them. Plus 30%. I don't know what that means, but I guess we'll make this. Um, with, uh, one of our striped nibblers. Oh. Your kitchen is always stocked with supplies, so the only ingredients you need to source are the fish. Okay, first go to the fridge and collect the necessary ingredients. My fish. <laughs> now move to the different stations around the kitchen and follow the instructions one by one. And be precise. Mistakes will lower the quality of your meal and its sale value. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Man, washing your hands is uh, difficult. Or washing the fish? I don't know what I'm doing, but it's hard. Huh. When the marker is in each zone to chop. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I'm getting the hang of it. I'm getting the hang of it. Uh, hold to release. Oh, okay. A little overcooked. Oh. Okay, okay. There are other stations on the kitchen, but you'll figure them out. I made a two-star fish cake. Not bad for my first attempt. I want to make another one. Oh. Alright, grab the ingredients. Wash the ingredients. All right, chop. Right, and then cook. Okay. I think I was a little under, undercooked that time, but. Not bad, two star again. Alright, I'll take it. Hey. Finally, always remember to put your cooked meals out for oh. sale. The storage box in your front yard will have to do for now. Alright, let's go put them for sale. Let's go put them for sale. Storage box. Oh, right here. <laughs> Perfect! Here you can sell the fish you catch and the meals you cook. Mm -hmm. Fish and meals will sell gradually throughout the day and the shells you earn will be transferred direct to your account. <laughs> hmm, this old box isn't very appealing. You should upgrade to a proper machine. Mm -hmm. Haru Grotto runs the tech shop. He'll give you a good deal. Oh. Speaking of new people, if you're exploring the waves, you'll need to recover your trawler. Chat to Sarah at the boat shop. Mm -hmm. Finally, for information about fish species and fill it in your journal, speak to Marina at the aquarium. Harrison, you're really serious about this? No one's been out on these waters for... 
three years since Robin, I know. <gasps> there are dozens, hundreds of strange and dangerous creatures out there. And we both know what it's like to lose someone. I'll be okay, trust me. Mm. So Sarah, Haru, and Marina, I'll see you soon. All right, where do we want to go first? We'll go to the boat shop, the tech store, or the aquarium. I mean, I guess we'll just go down the line, right? Like, uh, how do I object it? Uh, this is the tech shop. Uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna put a star. Track. To the tech shop. Who are you? Ah. Hello, darlings. So you're investigating unusual fish. You must seek out Old Bale, the notorious balloon like beast that upsets Ooh. children. It does? Why? Is it frightening? Mm. Oh no, dear, it's adorable. They're sad when it floats away. I see. Can I like, pick up the beach? I guess not. Who are you? Moon Glow is full of strange stories, Harrison. Try talking to people around town. Okay, Sophie. Nice to meet you. Who are you? Ah, Mr. Fisher, a very good day to you. <laughs> if you came looking for amusing nautical tales, I have none, so stop fishing. I see what you did there. That was a good pun. Yeah. Ah, oh, Harrison, long time no see. What can I help you with? Mm -hmm. Selling fish. Okay. Fish? Yes, fish. Why are we whispering? <sighs> uh, it's just been so long since anyone sailed the bay. What are you currently using? <gasps> Not much. My storefront is basically a storage box and an honor system. Oh, that's just sad. <laughs> what you need is a windowed poly vent. Oh. A vending machine for seafood? Mm. Absolutely. My dad ordered a few on special import, oh. but with half the town shut down, our three units in stock are proven tricky to shift. Oh. Tell you what, cook up and bring me some simple fish and chips. Ah. Maybe I'll swing you a new customer discount on the display oh. model. Sounds more like a cooking you lunch discount, but okay. It does sound like a cooking you lunch discount, but I will take it. Um... Let me go get some other quests. I like my dog. I don't know what their name is. Can I just name them whatever I want? Alright, let's go check out some of these other things. Well, if I'm just like running down the road. No cars here as far as I could tell. Hey, Harrison. Uh, Fisher. And hello to you, Sarah. Uh, Johnson. Been a while, huh? Finally come to collect your trawler? Exactly. The two cats. <laughs> Seriously? I thought I was making a joke. Clearly not a very funny one. Uh, In that case, let me find your paperwork. Yeah. Two cats. Yeah, clogged fuel pump and the intake valve is shot. For three years storage, you got off easy. Uh, It'll be a hundred shells for the repairs. You can pay me once I've finished the work. Uh, uh, hundred shells, are you sure? That seems low. Yeah, don't worry. It's the least. For Robin. Uh, Just give me a little time to finish up. I'll be in touch once the repairs are complete. How nice of her giving us the your loved one has been missing for three years discount. Welcome. Apologies, the aquarium isn't open for visitors. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm not a tourist. I'm looking for a marina. Ooh. At your service. Wait, Harrison, right? Robin's husband? Yeah. Robin was the soul of this place, the only sailor unfazed by all the legends. Someone who truly recognized the potential of both the aquarium and Moonglow. Mm -hmm. Potential for what? Yeah. To be famous. There are countless species out there unique to these waters. Just a handful would make the aquarium a huge tourist attraction. With a little investment, we could study the whole aquatic biome. Turn this archaic town of myths and monsters into a hub of scientific progress. But when Robin vanished, those dreams vanished too. How can I help? I, I'm fishing for my seafood business anyways. I could continue where Robin left off. Ah. Well, that would be incredible, but it's a huge undertaking. Ah. Quite simply, the aquarium needs new species, as many as yeah. you can find. The more unique creatures we house, the more visitors we'll yeah. attract. Business across town would benefit, including yours. Every new species you bring will boost your sales. Mm -hmm. Great. Where do I start? 
begin, just bring me three new species. Any three you can find. Well, I just so happen to have three new species, Robin. Uh, Harrison, how are you doing gathering those three different species? I'm working on it. How come no one's worked on it? Because of the curse. Sailors won't dare go out. I can fish from the pier, but I'm a hopeless mar mariner. You don't need to point, the, point out the irony. Um, donate fish. Oop. 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 Yes. Fantastic! This place is finally coming alive. Can't wait to tell Olivia. At this rate, I'll need to buy a whole new wing. Mm -hmm. So this is only the beginning, right? You need more? Yeah. Absolutely. Lots more. This is an ongoing enterprise. Oh. Remember, you're helping the whole community. Every new fish will increase the sale price of meals in your vending machine. Plus, as a personal thank you, I'll provide all the information I can for your journal. Yeah. Facts, fishing tips, plus any interesting folklore I come across. Unglo Bay has been plagued by myths and mysteries for decades, but with your help, we'll turn this ailing town into a beacon of progress. Yeah. Just remember, when you catch a new species, bring it straight here. All right. Look at this place. Look at that fish. I think there's supposed to be one there and there's not. This is one of the fish that I brought. Oh, actually two of the fish that I brought are in that one. Okay, cool. Um, this is very like Animal Crossing-esque, filling out the museum. Ah, uh, you're the maniac studying all the fish. Don't believe the legend? Wait till you see the primate pincher. Half crustacean, half primate, half primate, half horror from beyond the veil. Not that you'll need to listen to reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know I messed up that voice line really bad. Sorry, everyone. Hi, pupper. Are you enjoying out here in the sunlight? Yeah. Alright, we're gonna go home and figure out how to make some fish and chips. Uh, I do need a fish, though, so... Mia. Uh, where do I... Where do I fish? Can I fish here? I need to be, like, on a pier? Here's a pier. Oh, fish? I don't even know what bait I have or anything, but I just need one fish, so it's fine. Bay Ripple. Is this one of the ones I already had? I think it is. Uh, let me see. Bay Ripple. Oh, because I've turned them in. I have more information now. Thought to consume drowsiness, but only when consumed with a large plate of potato. That's funny. Where's my other fish? Oh, there we go. Bay Ripple. Yeah. That's one I already had. Okay, um... How do I... Here we go. I'm gonna just switch to the Jig Lure. Catch a couple more fish. I like that the fishing isn't too difficult. Because I'm someone who doesn't normally like fishing in games, to be completely honest. And uh, this is going well. The glowing shore, that's new. Alright, well, I will uh, hold on to that one, I suppose. So let's see if we can catch anything else. Oh. My line broke or something. What? What's happening? Okay. 
Did I get it? What the heck? I feel gypped. Another new one. All right. Um, I want to go make fish. Oh, that's how I do it. Oh, who are you? Oh, hello. You must be the owner of that delightful yellow pup. Oh. Yeah, Waffles. That's his name. He's a Nova Scotia duck tolling retriever. He likes chasing birds, barking at the front door, and rubs. Mm -hmm. I'm Harrison, by the way. I run a small street food business. In fact, I'm looking for new customers if there's anything you'd like to try. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, but nothing too rich or too spicy. How about just a basic steamed fish, just like they made in Malaysia? Thank you very much. All right, I got you, lady. I got you. I gotta make some fish and chips for this other guy, though, real quick, so. Alright. Fish and chips. Hook. Alright. Grab this. Chop. Alright. Fry. Perfect. All right. Get potatoes. Chop. And boil. Boiling potato chips. Or fries. Interesting. Okay. Great. Go. See if I can take it to the dude. Getting kind of late. Who are you? Uh -huh. Greetings, fellow angler. Know ye the mighty devourer? Ooh. That fiend will gobble up your whole wardrobe. Whole! Ooh. Really? And he likes some mahogany? <laughs> no, I mean your outfit, your clothes, small articles anyway. What I'm saying is it once ate a sock, I reckon. Thanks. Thanks for that, bud. Go away, raccoon. Alright. Oh. I ran into somebody, I think. Alright, where's the... Is this the shop? The fish and chip shop? Oh, they're probably closed, huh? What? What does this mean? They're open till 20 on cloudy days? Is it a cloudy day? It must be, right? If they're closed. Oh, wait. No, oh, they're open. Uh. Uh. I don't think this is right. I think I gotta bring it to the other kid. leave this place there it is how do I find the other guy uh, maybe I'll just do it tomorrow what is this oh I put that there I don't actually need that because of the quest markers um okay we're just gonna go he seems a little stuck can I help Ah, Harrison Fisher, your street food is the talk of the town. Yeah, thanks. Business seems to be on a steady rise. Perhaps I could interest you in something? My treat. What's your favorite? I haven't had tuna sashimi in a long time. Say no more. Next time we meet, I'll change that. Tuna sashimi. My treat. Why are we giving food away for free? We're trying to run a business here, Harrison. Hey, raccoon, get away from my food. Oops, I stopped to pet my dog, but I'm still mad at you, raccoon. 
Do I have food in there or is it empty? I don't know. Alright. I think it's time for bed. I don't like how slow I walk inside. Like, I get it, but I don't like it. Set an alarm for 6 o'clock in the morning. We're going to bed nice and early. Alright. Supposed to find something too. Oh, this is the dog's bed. I was like, what is that weird thing? It's the dog's bed. We gotta go outside. Oh. We have our own little pier back here. Alright, well, I'm gonna go do a little fishing off the pier. Twenty is eight PM, yes. Oh, another new species. Yeah, and I'm so good at finding new species of fish. Pollock. Another new species. Wow, the museum lady is going to be so happy. I have so many new fish to bring her. I messed up. Hit the button too soon. Nice. I kind of figured out the technique. You just go and like pull them in real quick right off the bat. Oops, I did it again. I get excited and then I pull too quickly. Another Pollock. Don't mind if I do. Alright, one more, one more. Alright, well that's good. I need fish to cook with, so having a bunch of the same is fine. Alright. We gotta go down to the tech store. Bring him his fish and chips. Hey bud, I brought you a fish and chip. Oh. I'll be waiting. Here you go. Mm. Haru, your fish and chips. Yeah. Impressive. Let's see. Attractive, plated, well seasoned, street style. Mm. Your presentation's top notch. The windowed poly event is exactly yeah. what you need. It's eye catching and simple to use. Your customers will happily pay a little extra per yeah. dish. Tell you what, I'll deliver the display model straight to your house. It's all yours. No charge. Ooh. That's extremely generous. Yeah. Just keep cooking while you're cooking. And think of Haru when you need an upgrade. That's so nice of him. All right, now we got to go down to the museum. Uh, I wonder where our daughter's staying. She just came here, got a job. Left wherever we're from and somewhere else in Canada. <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. Oh, she wants grilled octopus. Okay, um, anyways, I have this, this. This and this. Wow. Sweets. I thought we already gave her a Pollock, but maybe I'm crazy. <gasps> Look at the jellyfish. Do, 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 do. Is there anything else? So she needs more of those. That's fine. She needs a hundred monies. Return to Abby at the beach.
Uh, south. Okay. I don't have the boat yet, but I will have the boat. Someone's here? Oh. Success! I recovered the two cats and purchased a shiny new vending machine. <laughs> and that suddenly makes you Felix Wilson? Eh? Who? The angler, famously. So, what now? You attack the bay with a rod and a plucky attitude? Why? Is there something else I need? Ah. A net for starters? Come on, let me show you. Net fishing is a great way to acquire bait or to catch several small fish at once. It's also the only way to catch species that cannot be lured. See those black insects? Those are sand fleas. Mm -hmm. Sand fleas provide you with low grade bait, ideal for most fish in the bay. Uh -huh. Cast your net, tap button to build power, then tap again uh -huh. to release. Release when your arms are fully extended for a bigger throw. Give it a go. Okay. Caught some mite bugs. Hey. Great. One more. Cast out and reel in those swarms. I caught one more. <laughs> Feel free to come back and catch more anytime. Every sand flea produces three pieces of low grade bait. Mm -hmm. And you'll certainly be doing the beach a favor. Yep. Oh. Now you can take what you've learned out to the bay. Just look for any dark areas in the water, cast your net, and be sure to find something. Hi, Otis. I'm doing pretty good. How are you doing today? Um, hi, Dad. I just saw Sarah at the boat shop. The two cats is ready to go. Hmm, for the record, I really don't like you sailing out into the great blue yonder. Hmm. Why? Because of the monster. <sighs> Do not joke. People have lost their livelihoods to that thing. Not a monster. I know that much, and we've learned all we can from the shore. Mm. Then at least get a decent radio from Haru's shop. That way, if you get into trouble out there and need my tugboat and winch, you can call. Oh, that reminds me. I've been summoned to a meeting at Town Hall. Mm. Want to come along, Dad? I could introduce you to Mayor Trembley. Oh. Very fancy. I'll wear my best outfit. This one. <laughs> On the way, could you send home Casper? I'd rather not have both of you to worry about. <laughs> Be careful out there on the water, Harrison. I mean it. Uh -huh. It's gonna be a busy few days. What should we tackle first? Let's speak to Sarah at the boat shop. Get our trawler. There's a whole ocean out there to explore. I'd like to get away for a while. Sounds good. Um, should I catch more of these sand fleas? Yeah. Oh, hi, Mr. Fisher. Huh? Hey, Casper, what's up? You seem miles away. Oh, nothing. I smelled this herb a while ago. It reminds me of Dad. I can't think of the name. Huh? Cilantro? Miss Chips grows loads of it. It's pretty common. Huh. That's it. Dad used to cook this meal with it all the time. But I can barely remember what it tastes like now, and I don't want to ever forget. Hmm. Maybe we can help. It must be all these townspeople are like lost together and we're eventually gonna like find them all. That's my guess. Did I catch more fleas? Probably, right? All right, um, let's go this way. Please? Oh no, it's it bugged a little bit. Oh, my goodness. I'm glad you're having a good day, too, Otis. I'm glad. I'm glad. We gotta figure out how to make all these different dishes. I'm really liking this game. It's, like, a little sad, but really cute. Um, let me see. Anything you're looking for? Yeah, a radio, but I don't know how much it's gonna cost. 100 bucks. Um, these increase our sales. Meals, fish. 
Extra vending machine. Uh, we'll install one outside the tech shop and then one outside the aquaria. Cool, okay. Um, I'm broke, but I just wanted to see how much the radio was going to cost. Thank you. All right. Um, let me check. Getting pinged. Let me just check on this. Oh, let me just respond to this real quick. Sorry guys, let me just work real quick for a minute. There we go. All right. Um, <laughs> working stream. Cooking games games seem to be attracted to you. Cooking games, roguelike games. Yes, this is accurate. Okay, so let's see. Where were we at? Meet with Mayor Trembley outside the town hall. Um, the two cats, we have to pay for the repairs. Um, I don't know, I just need to go walk around and talk to a bunch of these people, I guess. Uh, is this the town hall? by the radio. This is we need to pay for our boat. We don't have the money for it though. Mm. <laughs> yeah, we gotta pay her. Alright, we need to make some money, which means we need to sell some food, which means we need to make some food. Um, I should take this one fish that I have that's in the town. That was being real cute right now. Do you guys see this? Do you guys see this? This cuteness? It's because I gave her some treats. I gave her some treats this morning with her- or not this morning, but like just before stream. With her, uh, with her dinner. She's being all cute about it. It's like preparing the Halloween treat bags all over again. I love my Halloween treat bags. It's a tradition, okay? What is what is this quest over here that's that made me to? Ah. Oh, the steamed purple uh, tail. Uh. Yeah. Purple tail. We need to catch purple tail. I don't know what that means. But we're gonna find one eventually. Alright. Oh, are you a deer? I wanna be your friend, deer. What? Or are they moose? We're in Canada. I bet they're moose. Look at my vending machine! Alright, let me uh, see if I can... Look, I can make steamed purple tail. I already have a purple tail. Sweet! Okay. Uh, let's see. Get fish. 
squash fish. Why does this fish move around so much in the sink? All right, um, chop the fish. Bake the fish. That's an easy recipe. Three stars. Okay, I can make another one of those, but I think the purple tail might be new. I can make fish cakes or fish and chips. Fish and chips sell for 16 and cost me 10, whereas fish cakes sell for 20 and cost me zero. Was the purple tail new or the pollock? I don't remember. Okay, so Pollock, we gave to the museum because we have the info on it. Purple Tail, we gave to the museum too because we have the info on it. So nothing in our inventory we need to take to the museum. Perfect. Okay. So we're going to make them both into these things. Okay. Watch. Perfect. Okay, chop. Boil. Perfect. Uh, fry. And then bake. It's like preparing the hollow tree bags. I just keep reading that same thing and I'm just like, no. All right, three stars. Um, What is this? Oh, we can make the bait. We should do that. We should definitely do that. Okay, we just get it and chop it into bait basically, okay. Let's make some more. Get it and chop it. Kind of gross that we make bait in our kitchen, but. tail for that kid. The other one goes in the machine. Fish cake. Alright. Is the kid still out here? Hey kid. You hanging around? Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. Kid might have gone to bed. It is kind of late. Like 10 p.m. Is this where he lives? Hey, kid. Hey, kid. Can't go in his house. All right. Well. I guess we'll go to bed. We'll find the kid in the morning. I think our food doesn't need to be refrigerated or go bad or anything like that. 6 a.m. <sighs> the pupper just goes running downstairs. He's like, I'm ready. I'm ready to go outside. Hi, Pupper. Okay. 
Is the kid out here? How early does this child wake up? He's here. Uh. Team Purple mm -hmm. Tail. Uh. Hey. Uh, submit. Uh. Casper, one steamed purple tail, just for uh. you. That's so kind, Mr. Fisher. It's weird. I was thinking how much smells and food can remind you of stuff. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Places and times, people especially. Yeah. And maybe how there's better ways of remembering someone than a recipe. Maybe it's more like how we live, how we approach every single day. Right, Dad? Yeah. Wait, yeah, yeah that, that's even better. Mm -hmm. Why? What were you going to say? Uh. Two recipes. Ah. I guess you can just have the second one. There's probably a lesson here. Definitely. Don't second guess a teenager. Alright, this thing is stuck on my screen. What if I say help I'm stuck? No, that doesn't do anything. What if I just catch more of these things? Because that's what got it bugged in the first place. Did the trick. All right, I need money. Which means I need to do more fishing. All right, so we're gonna use our low bakes. We have a whole bunch of it. Maybe we'll try some spinner, spinner lures, or spinner. Yeah, lure. That's the word. That's the word we're looking for. Ah, a new one. An ocean angel. I don't know why you'd ever want to throw them back. It's weird that it gives you that option. I guess if you're looking for something specific, but... Call it. Good, good. More fish we can make into food. Ocean Angel, let's go. Nice, another purple tail. I'm so good at fishing, guys. I don't know if you knew, but I'm a great fisherwoman. I guess in this game I'm a fisherman, but you know. Bay ripple fish. Maybe I'll go try to find a new place to fish. Yeah. Alright, let's go see. There's a new place to fish. I guess I could look at my map. South Beach, Central Beach, North Beach. The marina, south shore. So, I mean, I guess we'll just try, like, you know, down further on the beach. A whole new fishing spot. Same old fish so far. We'll see. Maybe that'll change. Maybe that'll change. Right. These fish seem to be very much the same. What if I switch to the plug lure? Oh, 
Okay, ripple fish. Give me something new. I did the thing again where I got excited. Uh, have I caught one of those before? I don't remember. Another ocean angel. Alright. Let's continue down to... Oh, I could catch these things. Just more little bugs. That's fine. Can I fish down here? Seem like it. Can I fish from the marina? Okay. Oh, I can fish out here. Uh, there's like seaweed out there. Wing. Come on, give me something new. Give me something new. A bay ripple. Doesn't seem like there's anything new out on the pier. Uh, that's fine. Uh, let's see. Hi. <gasps> I, w I didn't realize we'd be able to give her one of the mites, but that's cool. Uh, let's see. What other quests do we have? Oh yeah, the mayor. I wonder if I could go do that. Oh! Ah, the collector of fish and fable. Have you seen the ploy fish? Mm. Possibly. What does it look like? Oh. That's the thing. It wears a disguise. Like a secret mm. identity. What could a fish have to hide? And why is it never around when there's trouble? They're, they're good questions. Questions we ask ourselves. Oh, here we go. Huh. River and Harrison, welcome to the end times. What's going on? You're closing Town Hall. Huh? I have no choice. For years we've barely scraped by. Actually, River, that's why I wanted to speak to you. Huh? There's no money left for next year's centennial. There's no money left for anything. Huh. I'm afraid I can't hire you. Moonglow Moon Glow Bay is finished. Yeah. What? That's the whole reason I'm here, to help with repairs and funding. <sighs> Surely we could do something. <laughs> You're kind, but it's too late. Every building, business, and public space needs renovating. Irony is, the townsfolk have shells to spare. Just look at the bulletin board. But no one is willing to invest. The cozy cavern alone. <sighs> okay, so we start there. Just please, keep this place running a little while longer. You know what, Harrison? Why not? One last hurrah! Town hall stays open. Well, <laughs> Good luck, Mr. Fisher and River. I'll see you on Monday. Dad, you shouldn't have done that, making promises. Yes, I did. For three years, I watched this town crack and crumble. Robin would have never let that happen. They would fight every day. What do we need to do? Quite simply, invest in as many properties as possible. Every renovation will steadily improve tourism across all of Moonglow, mm. which will gradually increase the sale price of each meal you sell. Huh. Keep an eye out for renovation signs across town, then invest when you can. Mm -hmm. Come on, let's check out the cozy cavern. Alright. New task. There's something here. Oh, the bulletin board. Huh? Is this what the mayor was talking about? Mm. Yep, the town bulletin board. Seems there's still high demand for seafood, even if no one wants to fish. <laughs> These small jobs could be a great way to generate some extra income. Pick a task and let's get cracking. Uh, favor for Paris. Well, Helma has a fishy tail. Or help Reese. Reese has a small request. Why is Minion? I'm gonna do this one. 
I don't have a water baby or a wise minion. I don't know what either of those are. This one only has one day, so I'm just going to go with what I have for right now. I don't know what this is, but we're going to see if we can find out. Huh. Hey, Harrison, I've got one for your journal, the ghostly swordfish. Whoa. Outstanding. What's ghostly about it? All sorts. It's red eyes, it's haunted expression, plus it gives everyone the heebie-jeebies. Okay, for now I'm just gonna put the name. Okay, and that completed a quest for me? Um, found bulletin board. Complete three requests. Got you. Invest in the cozy cavern. Uh, it's, that's being tracked, but... Well, I don't know. Anyways, we'll worry about it in the morning. It's getting late. I need to make some more food to sell so I can... Uh, uh, so I can make money and get my boat back. Don't mind me, just keeping my fleas in the fridge. Uh, the sizzling fish requires a ling, sells for 25. So, I mean, yeah, that makes sense. A couple of those. Uh, wash first. You got it. This is like the fishing minigame in Stardew that I'm bad at. Chop. I like these ones better. The little ones where you just push the buttons at the right time. They're way more up my alley. This one's not bad. And this one's not bad, yeah. Perfect. Alright, uh, this sells for 25 and also costs zero, so yeah, I'll make a couple of those. Perfect amount of time. Alright. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. This makes way more sense. Um, I already took this to the thing, right? I'm pretty sure. Alright. Scrub the fish. Wash the fish. Chop the fish. And then boil the fish. And then fry the fish. This one has so many steps. And I get why. Three stars. All right, one more time. Grab their ingredients. Wash them up. Chop them up. Boil them up.
I feel like the washing, in my opinion, just needs a little bit more time on the timer. Because the boiling gives you plenty of extra time if you mess up a little bit. The washing does not. Alright, that's everything. That's all we could do. Let's put it in the vending machine. Um, oh, I should probably check my quest real quick just to make sure. So, the bulletin board... Monsters... Um, two cats... Radio... Working on that... Okay, yeah, nothing we have right now requires any specific recipes. Okay, sizzling fish... Purple, whatever... And these things in the vending machine. You think they'll sell overnight or only in the morning? I don't know how that works. 6 a.m. <laughs> All right. Time to head downstairs. Oh my god, we're rich! 378 bucks. Alright, now we can go get our boat back. So it did all sell overnight, huh? Good to know. I wonder why we would ever need more than one vending machine. She has three little doggies following her around. That's so cute. I didn't notice that before. Okay, um, fanged nipper. Water babies. I don't know how to catch either of those. Mm -hmm. Hello, Mrs. Gatto. I run a small business and I'm gauging interest in different recipes. You see, like, someone who knows a lot yeah. of people. What are you implying? Oh. Nothing. Just let you know everyone in town. Nothing untoward. Oh. Mm, I don't usually care for seafood, but perhaps I could sample your surf and turf. <laughs> sure, no problem. Happy to oblige. Alright, we're doing surf and turf, apparently. All right, we need a radio. Sounds like a plan. I don't know why I would want this, but I, I might want it. I have 178 to mess around with, so I'll take it. Oh, now I can buy film packs and filters. For my, uh, for my camera, I see. Required for taking photos. Cozy, cool it down. 18 film. 9 film. This camera, you're happy for me to just have it? The old Parallax 3000? Sure, it's broken anyways. Don't give me that look, we can't fix everything here. Please don't, all sales are final and non-refundable. So basically it's a fancy paperweight. Unless you know some kind of professional photographer. Jesus Rodriguez, is a professional photographer. Jesus. Oh right, in that case, could you take a photo of the shop once it's fixed? A nice one, for posters. Consider a payment for the potentially functioning camera. I paid for that camera. What do you mean? Uh, oh gosh. There's quests around here. Hey, hey Zeus, what can you tell me about cameras? Oh. Wow, where to begin? In 1825, the first heliographic image was created mm. by... Specifically, what can you tell me about this camera? Good. Oh, it's a Parallax 3000. High shutter speed, decent zoom. You got some chewing gum here in the focus ring. Yeah. Let me just, ugh, there. Um, Did you uh? fix it? Was it broken? <laughs> I guess not. Can we try it out? Take your picture? Oh. Better yet, let's take a shot of both of us. It's the latest fad. You take a photo of yourself. Mm. It's called mm -hmm. a self-taken, self-portrait. Oh. E. 
Oh. Hold the camera out. This is how you switch views for a self portrait. -y. Uh, LT. Oh. Oh, there's your beautiful face. Perfect time to take that photo. <laughs> I'll do that one. Can I zoom? Oh yeah, I can zoom out a little. Hey. And voila! You should ask around. Folks are always happy to pose for a photo. It's flattering. <laughs> Just remember to keep plenty of film handy. The tech store usually has plenty in stock. <clears throat> Great. Speaking of go-to tech, I owe them a photo of the shop front. Thanks, Jesus. Uh, sure. I'll keep the picture of me and Jesus. Oh, I need to be further away, I think. like the the thing in the way there there we go hey lady get out of my picture oh. good enough this will be perfect for their posters great hmm <clears throat> Hey, as promised, a storefront photo for your new ad campaign. Yeah. Great, and in return, well, you already have the camera. What are you going to do with it? Immortalize the fine faces of Moonglow with a collection of self-taken self portraits I thought you might have more myth-busting ambitions out on the waves. Mm -hmm. Like what? Hey. No idea. Who do I look like, Marina? Oh, sounds like I need to talk to Marina. About taking some pictures of some mysterious sea creatures. All right, let me go pay off my boat first. Maybe? How do I get into this place? Here we go. Yeah. Good timing. I just finished replacing the intel uh. intake valve. And for you, the keys to the two cats. Thanks very much. <coughs> I don't see a car. How are you towing it? I'm not. I'm sailing. Sailing? Yeah, on the bay. Mm. On the bay? Huh? Are you all right? Sorry, yeah, but no one ever sails on Moongo Bay. Not since, uh... The collapse. Let's just say the tides are turning. In that case, I know one young girl who will certainly be pleased. Uh. Claire, Abby's daughter? If you catch up with her, she might have a small job for you. Aside from that, be safe out there. These are strange waters. Huh. Woo! The world is our oyster, and our fish, and our lobster, and every other creature out there. Ha ha ha. Where should we explore first? What's out there? Whoa. A lot, and weather can shift dramatically depending where we go. We're in the calm bay waters here, but it gets a lot colder near the glaciers to the north. Huh. And over to the east, there's the waking storm and the hot springs. Each area is split into sections, which will help you navigate. For now, let's cut some fish in the bay waters yeah. area. Let's check out the Azure Crossing, Perching Isles, and Border Sea. Alright. How do I... Oh. Uh, uh. How doth I steer? Like, how do I... I'm trying to figure out how to go forward. Uh, here. Oh. Uh, I'm the steer button. Oh, there we go. So if I... Uh-huh, I need to get better at this. Okay. Oh my god, okay. If I go over here... Try to not scare the fish away. Okay, I'm gonna pull out my net. Did I catch a bunch of fish? No. I don't know how that works. Hey. Those the fish I need to catch with my net? Not fast enough. Hmm. 
Hmm. I have to worry about fuel at all. I don't think I caught any fish. Okay. Ugh. What's the phone for? Oh. Hey, Harrison, do you need to tow back to town? It'll cost you 14 altogether. Not right now. Thank you. Hey, can I park here? I can. I can anchor right near home. Aha! Sweet, okay, cool. Um... I gotta go talk to Marina, and I got like a whole bunch of other stuff to do. This little girl wants to talk to me. Uh. Uh. What? Everything okay, Claire? Uh. I don't care why people can't tidy their own mess. Huh? You should have seen Dad's living room, it was like a noodly crash site. <laughs> I mean, the bay, there's so much garbage, it makes mom sad too. <laughs> then, uh, let me help you both out. Why don't I fish some of that out of the trash? <laughs> oh, sorry, guys. I can't put it on. Oh, I'd be your friend forever! Uh -huh. Although cleaning the bay really ought to be its own reward. Uh huh. Uh -huh. So, uh, you know, you're very wise for a nine year old. Nine and three quarters. Thank you, thank you. Alright. Um, there's someone else I could talk to. It's a rainy. It makes me think that it's nighttime, but it's not. It's just rainy time. But yeah, I don't fully understand how the uh, how the the net works out in the water, so we're gonna have to mess with that. Ooh, Harrison, ooh, is that a new camera? <laughs> yes, it's a Parallax 3000. Great shutter speed. Add some chewing gum right here in the zoom. You know how to use it. Only I saw you earlier holding it backwards. It's the new fad. Don't criticize where you put your obnoxious corkboard. Wow. Oh, that's for a new project. I'm cataloging the giant fossils all over the bay. Yeah. Olivia was going to document them, but since you have your Parallax 3000... <sighs> are you sure, Marina? Are you sure I won't hold it backwards and take pictures of my nose? Ah. Don't prove me wrong, Ansel Adams. There are five large fossils I need photographed. Two in the calm waters of the bay, three in the icy north. Yeah. The fossils are all high above sea level embedded in the rock. They're massive, so you'll know when you find one. <sighs> all right, but I'm doing this because I want to. Not because I have something to prove. Eh? What kind of fossils are they anyway? Ah. That, Harrison, is precisely the question. Good luck. Have any fish for you? No, I do not. What did you want again? Uh, uh? Oh. Ah. I don't remember what food she wanted, but it's fine. Alright, I have a quest over here that I can do something with. And I should probably check the quest board, too. Uh, Fang, Nipper, Water Babies, yeah, those are, I don't think, very helpful to us. We gotta go out on the bay and do some fishing. Mm -hmm. Ah, the angler with the journal. Good luck studying the vanishing trawler. It vanishes when observed. Thanks, I'll look out for it. Or should I not look out for it? What would you suggest? That you observe around the fish. Look everywhere that it isn't. Alright, sounds easy enough. I'm doing that much right now. Great, cool. Um, time to go out on our boat, it seems like. We gotta go do some fishing. Uh, let's see. Let's do some spinner lure. With bait. Keep messing that up. Can I use my net? No. Okay. I keep trying.
trying to figure out this net thing. You a shell I need to take a picture of? How do I know if you're a fossil? What do fossils look like? It kind of looks fossil-y. Do I just take a picture of it and just hope? Wait, I guess I cannot. Okay, there was something over here. Here, what are you? Another boat. Can I do anything with you? I guess not. Okay. Looking for fossils. Fossils? Fossils? Are you a fossil? That's not. I'm assuming if it's something I need to take a picture of, the camera will come up. Uh, open chill. It's the the frigid north where I don't think we want to be. Frosted skates. back to the bay yeah okay oh it shows me these objectives okay I want to head to this one Can I uh damn Um, I can't see that on my thing. I think it's this one though. It is not. It is down this way. Don't hit the ice. We've seen Titanic. Definitely headed the right way. Uh, I think there's penguins. Oh, there's. Those are cute. Can I take a picture of you? <gasps> Hello! Oh, they're so cute. Okay, so I can take a picture of whatever I want, I guess. I just was hitting the wrong button. There's something I need to take a picture of here, I think. What's what is this objective? I don't understand. I guess I could try doing some fishing. Another new species. I didn't know about being so cute up there. Oh, another new species. 
we're finding so many fish. We can change our lure too. Maybe find even more. Let's see, let's see. Uh, let's see here. Try our jig lure. Dave. <laughs> Dave is a square. That's funny. I lost that one. A moon eel. <laughs> the seals behind me. They're just so loud. Some fish don't like being pulled right away, I guess. Inspector fish. He looks interesting. All right, one more, one more. And then we'll switch to the other bait, or the other lure. The chin cutter. All right, all right, let's try the other one, let's try the other one. Uh, here. Boop. Boop, boop. Okay, okay. Kite spider, we're familiar with that one. Come on, give me something new and big. <gasps> An itching demon. Oh my, he looks interesting. That's the kind of fish I'm looking for. He looks so cool. Uh, sinking black. We've been out here all day and all night. It's 6 a.m. I'm glad we don't have to sleep if we don't want to. Neil? Nice. Okay. Um, let's keep going. Uh, let's see. Let's go to one of our other objectives. Um, she said the things we're looking for. I don't even know what this objective is, though. She said the things we're looking for stick up pretty far out of the water. So, well, anyways, we're going to go the way that we're facing. We can go back towards town. Keep an eye out for the things sticking up out of the water. Is this the black stuff I'm supposed to collect? What is that? Oh. I'm hearing creepy noises. Are you guys also hearing the creepy noises? Cleaning up the bay. Cleaning up the bay. The heck is that noise? Doom. Oh, good 
Creepy noises are creepy. All right. Azure Crossing. Oh, it looks like there's something straight ahead that looks kind of interesting. Like, are any of you, like, are you a fossil? You a fossil? No clue. I'm gonna assume you might be, though. What is that? because I like collect them but then they stay in the water that part's a little confusing all right let's head this way for a teensy bit how many things was I supposed to clean up out of the water oh a small island and lonely rock Small island in Lonely Rock. Lonely Rock. I don't even see Lonely Rock. Okay. Continue this way. Perching Isles. You look like something I should collect. No? You're not? Okay. I guess not. Cool. Great. Wonderful. Why do they look so, like, weird and glitchy? I don't know. Um, sure, let's go check out this zone. Maybe this is Lonely Rock. The Border Sea. Perching Isles. The Border Sea. South Shore. Zero Crossing. That could Lonely Rock. I guess we could do a hard right and see what this is. Even more hard right. There's something over here that we're supposed to do. Just, it, it, what? I have no clue. One of them it said was near the railroad crossing, right? Uh, let's see. Where, where the heck is that quest? Here we go. Yeah, the border sea fossil. Above a beach near the railway track. And the railway tracks right over there so if we just do a hard turn we'll head towards the railway track see if we can find one of these fossils at least before i call it a day on this video game Okay, railway track. And then it said... Above a beach near the railway track. Okay. 
Seems like it's pretty much like straight ahead. Of a beach. Are you a fossil? You said they're pretty big. Are you, are you a fossil? I think I'm still too close. get the whole thing. Yeah. Go straight this way and then turn. Okay, let's try this. There we go. Oh, one fossil documented. Holding my camera backwards indeed. Okay, so I did get one. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Now I kind of know what they look like. All right, we'll just follow this around. Perching Isles. Wait, wasn't that? Lonely Rock. Open Chill. Broken Glaciers. Icy Wall. Lonely Rock. Oh, where Lonely Rock is. Perching Isles. One of them was... Perching Isles? Or was it just that we're in Perching Isles? Yeah, Lonely Rock. We don't know where Lonely Rock is. We do know where the open chill is. Icy wall. Ah, oh, recess about some trees and broken glaciers. So these are showing us the places, just not super well. I understand. Okay. Boat icon track. The boat, the icons are not super helpful. But I don't know. Anyways, I probably got to get going. I gotta go make myself some food. Is she stranded? Looks like this is like a shipwreck. He's just like stranded out here. Hello? Are you okay? Like, doesn't it look like they're, like, stranded? Oh, did I get myself stuck? Oh no, I'm good. The, like, creepy noises I was hearing is just my boat. I thought my boat sounded creepy. It does kind of sound creepy. What happened over here? I just need to go check it out. I think it's attached to the main island, but like It looks like someone's living in like a little shack there, which is crazy Bungalow Bay 
That's not a fossil, right? It's not an objective zone. So I'm guessing it's not. Anchor. I'm curious about what's going on over here. This. It looks like someone's living in here. But no, they're not. It's just like a weird broken box. Hey, hey, yeah, you, looking for a weird fish, right? Then watch out, there's a modeled creature out there that lures sailors to their doom. You mean a siren? I mean a demon! Okay, cool, very wonderful. I wanna go see what's down here real quick. What are you? Oh, this is where you go to the railroad track, right? There's like, leaves on the railroad track? A beaver! What's up, bud? Couple beavers. Okay, cool. Well, guys, I think this game's pretty darn cute. It's telling me that I need to sleep, which is fair. I haven't slept in a couple days. Um, but yeah, I think this game's pretty darn cute. I hope you guys agree. If you want to see more of it, just let me know. But I think I'll probably call it a day on this game for now. Ugh. Ugh. Goodness, excuse me. All right, let's give it a good old... Oh, I think we just saved when we slept. That makes sense. Let's give it a good old quit. <laughs> thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you, thank you. Let me find someone for us to raid it into over on Twitch. And thank you to everyone watching across all the other platforms as well. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed some Moon Glow Bay. Let me just do my little advertisement bit for them real quick. Um, let me see here. So, Moon Glow Bay um, came out a couple years ago. However, um, they just launched on Nintendo Switch and PlayStation um, and got the Picture Perfect update. So, the camera that we've been messing around with today is all completely new that they added in um, for the console launch. So, that's really exciting. Um, so, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to check it out, it's over on Listeem. Uh, and that's about it. That's about the dealio. Um, who's hanging around? We've got... God, we've got... Um, Ruff's playing some Planet Crafter. That sounds interesting. I have never heard of that, so let's go check it out. We're gonna go see our friend Ruff. I'm gonna post the raid message in case anyone wants to take that along to go and say hello. Um, until next time, make sure that everyone takes care of themselves. Make sure you get some good sleep. Make sure you eat some good food. Make sure you drink enough water. Make sure you take your meds. Make sure you guys do all the things that you need to do so I can see you guys tomorrow around 1 p.m. Eastern time. And until then, bye-bye, everyone.